How are you? À, tao nói chuyện That's với cô giáo nhé, chú đi ra ngoài một tí. Vâng ạ. Ok, hai cháu. I'm fine. Okay. That's good. That's good. Um, so how old are you? Uh, I am uh, 14 years old. Wow, awesome. Okay, and let's let's get to know each other a little bit. Okay. So my name is Dominique. Okay. Okay. And you can call me uh, Teacher D for short if Dominique is too long. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay, so uh, can you tell me uh, what is your favorite color? Uh, my favorite colors is uh, blue. Nice. High blue. Okay, awesome. Yeah, I, I also like blue. Blue is a really cool color. Yes, yeah. I think so. Yeah, me too. All right, and what is your favorite animal? My favorite animal is uh, maybe a dog. A dog, cool. Yeah. Why? Because uh, it is so very friendly. <laughs> yeah, dogs are super friendly and cute too. Okay, maybe, but uh, with the puppy. Yeah, I agree. Puppies are really cute. <laughs> All right, and where are you from? I'm from Vietnam. Okay, where in Vietnam were you born? I'm born in uh, Hanoi. Hanoi, nice. Okay, so you lived there since you were small? Uh, yes, uh, I have uh, moved to Hanoi uh, since I was uh, two years old. Okay, and where were you before? Uh, I live in my uh, uh, my uh, grandparents' house in uh, another city. Okay, do you know the name of the city? Uh, I think you don't know because it's not really uh, famous. Okay, yeah, maybe. Do you, can you tell me what the name is? It's a uh, Futa. Futa. Okay. Cool. Are you right? I have never heard of this one. <laughs> okay. All right. So, um, I am from South Africa. Do you know where South Africa is? Yes. Yeah. It's uh, under the Europe. Under Europe? Yes, maybe. Yeah. Uh, um, it's uh, next to Asia, right? Next to where? Asia. Oh, Asia? No, let me show you. I will show you where my country is. So if we look on the map, there is South Africa. Can you see that? Oh, uh, yes. So there is South Africa over here, right at the bottom. Yeah, it's super far, right? Here is yes. Vietnam and there is South Africa. So it's quite far. Did you... Um, do you study different countries in your school? Uh, yes, I have to study uh, English at uh, my school. Okay. And um, let's have a look. I have a small activity that we can do for the start of the class. Uh, okay. I just want to see um, what your level of English is so that we know for the next lesson, right? Okay. Okay, right. So I'm going to share this with you. And 
I want us to read it together. So you can be the guy and I will be the girl. Okay, yeah. All right. Let's start so, now. Start yeah, now. let's do it. Yeah. Uh, what is Maria doing? Good. She's cutting paper. Uh, no, she isn't. She's using the computer. Good. All right. Um, you can carry on over here. No, she isn't, Luke. Now Maria is writing on the board. No, look over here. Maria is gluing a picture. Nice. All right. How many Marias are there in our class? There is one Maria here. Good. And there is one Maria here. Good. Yeah. There are two Marias. <laughs> you were supposed to read that one, but it's okay. <laughs> All right. Awesome. So... If we look at the story and match, I think this is quite easy for you. I think your English level is a little bit high. Um, but let's do it anyway, right? Let's have some fun. <laughs> Something easy, yeah? Uh, yes. All right. Okay, so number one, what does number one say? Number one is A. Yeah, good. Number one is A, cool. Uh, and number two, who's gluing the pictures? Two is a B. Cool. Uh, number three, she's using the computer. Uh, um, sorry, I can't remember it. She's using the computer. Uh, it's a B. B, right? Can you hear me? Yes. All right. Let me just do this quickly. Um, I think the sound is gone. All right, can you hear me now? Yes. All right, awesome. Okay. All right, so I think I think your level is actually quite advanced. So you do English in school? Uh, I have learned English in school and uh, another uh, in the, my uh, another class outside the school. Perfect. And uh, do you know what level you are on? Uh. I have, now I have to learn uh, IELTS level one. Level one, a oh, perfect. Yes. Okay, awesome. Very good. Well done. Your English is really good. I'm proud of you, Ming. Oh, uh, thank you. Yeah, sure, no problem. All right, so. Okay, so this exercise is quite simple. Okay, so here is a dialogue, okay? Um, yes. you, you can be Billy and I will be Susie. Do you know what a dialogue is? Yes, it's uh, two people talk together. Exactly. Maybe. Good, yes, very good. What is a monologue? Monologue, uh, maybe, uh, I think it's uh, two people have uh, talked it in the past and someone talk it uh, repeat it again to another people maybe okay okay so a monologue is actually one person speaking that is a monologue so that's for one person acting out a um, a script so that would be a monologue a dialogue is two people yes okay all right, so let's give it a read. Let's see what it has to say. You can, you can be Billy. Okay, what, what is uh, Timmy doing? Good. He's playing a computer game. Uh, it looks like fun. Let's play a computer game too. Good, sorry. 
There's no, there's only one computer. Oh, too bad. But I have a DVD. Let's watch a movie. All right, cool. So, um, do you know what intonation is, Ming? Sorry. Intonation. Intonation. Yes. Oh, I don't so, know. That's okay. Right. So intonation. Um, intonation is how you speak and how you say your words. So for example, if I say, um, hello Ming, how are you today? I'm having so much fun. This is great. This is cool. There's no intonation. It's kind of like flat, right? Oh. So when we do dialogues and when we do monologues, you're actually doing a really good job. Um, there has to be intonation when you read, right? Yes. Yeah. So, for example, saying, um, how are you today? Did you hear some levels of sound? Yes. Yeah, there's so many. So, um, when we read dialogues, it's always important to remember that you have to have a lot of different sounds when you say them, right? So yes. let's go back. Let's go back to this small dialogue that we have over here. Okay. Right, so um, let's look at um, Billy saying here, oh, too bad. How how would you say that? Uh, no, will we, I will talk it again. Yeah, yeah. Oh, too bad. Exactly. Good job. Nice. All right. So that is that's what intonation is, and it's bringing it makes a story come alive. And when you speak to people too, when you speak to your friends, it's always nice to have really good intonation when you talk with them, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay, let's see what else this activity has. All right, so it says, look and listen, then write. Right, so what are they doing here? Uh, they are playing soccer. Good, all right. So I want to practice a sound with you, okay? So you see these two letters here. They are. Okay. So this sound over here is. So you have to, you have to put your tongue. Let me, let me stop sharing so I can show you. All right. So that sound, the T and the H is like this. Mm. Yes. There. There. Yeah. There you go. That's exactly how it is. There. There. Yes. Very good. Well done. All right. Let's carry on. So that sound is actually very important because um, in Vietnamese, um, it can be confused with Z. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So it's something to think about a lot when you read, okay? So they're playing soccer, right? Yes. Okay, can you say there again for me? There. 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 Good, nice, good job, Ming. All right, number two, what are they doing in number two? Uh, she's reading a book. Good job, she's reading a book. All right. Let's have a look at this sound over here. Okay. Shh. So this sound, you kind of like, you look a bit funny when you do this. <laughs> it's not, a, it's not a, a cool sound, but this is how it's supposed to sound. Shh. Shh. Exactly that, good, right? 
So she's. She's. Good. She's. She is. Good. So instead of saying she is, we say she's. She's. There you go. You got it. Nice, Ming. She's. She's. Good. Nice. All right. So she's, what is she doing? She's uh, reading a book. Good. Nice. All right. Number three, what are they doing? They are listening to music. Good job. Nice. And number four? Uh, he is uh, writing, a num uh, writing numbers. Good. Nice. All right. So try and say he's. He's. Good. And there. There. Good. There. There. Yeah. There you go. Nice. All right, so there is short for they are. Okay. And she's is short for what? Okay. What what is she's short for? What what is she's? She is. Good. He's. Uh he is. Good. There. They are. Nice. Good. Very good. Okay. All right, we're not going to do this. Do you know what plus is, Ming? Yes. All right. So it's adding, right? Adding numbers. Yes. Okay. Fantastic. Okay. Let's have a look and see what these children are doing. So sometimes class does not necessarily have to be in a classroom, right? Uh, yes, but it's uh, not in Vietnam. Yeah. Oh, so you don't go outside of your class in Vietnam? Uh, we we uh, don't. Uh... We can we go out go out of school to the end of class? Oh, okay. So you don't. Yes. Okay. All right. And in do you go to places and learn with your friends? Uh no, I haven't do it. Okay. So you just go home, right? Yes. Okay, awesome. So sometimes in some schools, you say it does not happen in Vietnam. Um, in place other schools, sometimes they do day trips outside of school. Uh, but uh, we do in this trip, we don't have to learn, only go out to play to relax. Okay, so where do you go? Uh, we all can uh, be go to uh, the water park or uh, the farm. Oh, nice. And and what did you learn? What did you learn the farm? Uh, we learned to maybe plant the tree or yeah. feed, uh, feed the animal. Yeah. That's all. Okay, well, that's really cool. So that's kind of like a classroom, right? Uh, yes. See? Okay, so let's, let's have a look and see what these students do. All right, so what does number one say? Can you read that for me? Uh, these students in Turkey are in the forest. Mm -hmm. they, they are studying trees and animals. Good job. Yeah, all right. That's really cool. Um, the first word, let's have a look at this first word here. These. These. Yes, these. These. Yeah, there you go, nice. All right, um, number two, let's have a read. 
these students in France are having a PE class in the mountains. They love to ski. Ski. A ski. Yeah. So, um, these. Do you know what PE class is? Yes. Okay. It's do you a, like PE class? Yes, I really love it. <laughs> That's good. Nice. All right, and number three. These students in the United States are having a science class in the school garden. They are, they are growing plants and flowers. Good, growing. Growing. Growing, yes. Good, nice. All right, and last one, number four. Now, these students in Bangladesh are studying English in uh, their school is a boat. Bangladesh is a wet country. Sometimes schools close, but this uh, school is always open. Nice. Okay, right. So you can see there's different places all over the world and they have different classrooms outside of a class, right? Yes. Which one would you like to do more? Sorry? Which class would you like to be a part of more? Which uh, one do you in, like? In four pictures. Yes. In the four pictures, which class do you want to do? I think it's uh, number two uh, uh, PE class. Okay, why? Because uh, I am a big fan of uh, football. Nice. And I uh, like to play football in the PE class. Okay, awesome. Cool. Yeah, and would you like to learn how to ski? Um, uh, I think in Vietnam, it's a uh, never have a uh, uh, snow to ski. So I think it's not necessary. Yeah, yeah. Unless you go to Sapa, I think it snows in Sapa. But uh, in uh, my country, when the snow is uh, too uh, like wet, but in uh, I have to go to uh, another country where the snow here is. Uh, I think it's not wet, and we can ski. Yeah, it'll be a little bit difficult, right? Yes. Okay, awesome. All right, Bing, it was so, so, so uh, awesome to meet you and yes. to have our first lesson together today. Okay? okay. So today was just to get to know each other and to see what level you are on. Um, so well done. Yes, sir. Thank you. All right. Thank you so much, Ming. Goodbye. Have a good day. Goodbye. Thank you. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. Tony, are you here? Yes, I'm here. Okay, cool. Uh, now, um, last one. Yes. Uh, can you could, could you remember how to um, review student or we will write uh, immediately after class? Uh, sorry, what? We need to give reviews for students. Okay. Yeah, and do you see the Excel link? The link I gave you before. There is yeah. one column. It means okay. So, uh, yeah, yeah, I send it. Okay, so then do I need to comment? Yes. Like, uh, we will take notes for student and do, do you see the the comment from teacher column. Yeah, I see it. Uh, so do I do I do this now? Uh, now? Yes. Uh, like five minutes after each students, we will write our comments. 
All right. Yeah. Can you type on the five file? Uh, yeah, I'm just trying to look for the comment section. Comment section is uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. The, uh, the six column. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's just difficult to see it on the phone because... Uh, yeah, it's hard when you see it on phone. You should see it on the... Yeah, let me just quickly log in. Computer. So now what's going to happen with that child because that child is quite advanced. Are we still going to follow this, uh, this book? Yeah, I'm not sure uh, Maya will tell us what to do. We'll okay. And her the video and how she will plan the curriculum for, for him. Okay, yeah, because uh, I, I I think that that book is okay, but he's already taking extra lessons somewhere else. So I think his English is a little bit uh, advanced. Yep. But he's still shy, huh? Not really. Uh, I think he was quite interactive. Uh, yeah. Okay. He shared. He shared quite a lot. Yep. Where do you live at the moment? Where's Sorry? Like? Where do you live at the moment? Where do I live? Yeah, what's like? Um, in Tulium. Ah, yeah, okay, okay, I know. Mm. Nice to me. Do you know Embassy Garden? Yes, yes. Mm, yeah. Mm, yeah. Do you stay there? Yeah, I'm, I'm staying there. Oh, well, then we're very close because I stay in Tosseco. <laughs> Where? Tosseco. Ah, okay, cool, cool. So you're nice to me. Yeah. <laughs> you decorated your background? I did. <laughs> did it <today> <laughs> Uh, I, I did it uh, like an hour before <laughs> this. That's cool. So you are a dedicated teacher <laughs> yeah for sure for sure I definitely am dedicated <laughs> yeah okay so uh, uh, his younger sister will come his young so this is his younger sister yeah of me yeah okay <laughs> Um, is it quite popular in Chinese online teaching? Yeah, I think it's I think it's gonna become popular here in Vietnam. Yeah, it's gonna become popular because of the coronavirus. So oh yeah, a lot of people are gonna be doing online teaching now. <laughs> 
Yeah, it's a good thing. It's a good thing you guys started this uh, yeah, yeah. now. Very clever. Yeah, still a lot of things to do. I can imagine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But it's okay. The process, it'll work out. It'll be okay. Yeah. The beginning is always a bit difficult. Towards the end, it gets better. Yeah. How long you been stay in Vietnam? Uh, 